My name is Ryan Beck. I'm co-founder and CTO of Pray.com, the number one app for prayer and meditation. And we work with the largest ministries and nonprofits across the globe to help them go digital and connect with new members online. Like uh, other tech companies, AI is of great importance and that is uh, the major focus for the company. And how we were born uh, in 2016 was that we saw a gap in the faith space in which we saw it as a laggard industry when it came to technology adoption. So we wanted to be that digital destination, that technological arm for faith. And so when we see a technology like AI and these large language models and diffusion models come on, we want to make sure that we adopt it for our ministry partners and nonprofits so that they can make an impact in a big way using the latest and greatest technology. So AI specifically, and where we see and what we're able to do with video is not just with translations, but going even beyond that of creating additional pieces of content with our partners uh, that they wouldn't be able to create before because it just take too much time. And so I see building that digital twin or that AI avatar of, of these leaders or these creators uh, to do more with the time that they have to get their message out uh, is uh, one of the things I look forward to most. So the magic moment for us was actually um, one of our teammates who's out of Argentina. Uh, we we're doing a hackathon and we're getting ideas for the hackathon. And he, we asked everybody to submit an idea for this hackathon. And he submitted a video of one of our ministry partners speaking in Spanish. And this guy is from Texas. He does not speak Spanish at all. 75 year old guy, Texan. And it sounded just like him. And we sent it to him and he was blown away like we were blown away. And so that created a huge initiative for us and it opened up the eyes of our industry to the magic that AI can bring into organizations and into the world uh, that I think maybe people don't see. And this was one of those magic moments for us and also for our customers. AI translations has been huge for us because it allows our current ministries and nonprofits that are on our platform to speak to members of their organization or the people they impact in these global communities in their native tongue. They've never been able to do that before. They usually speak in English and then they have a translator and then the people in these countries will hear them for the first time. And you have to remember, these are the people that started these organizations and these organizations drive impact in these local communities in Africa and Asia and South America. And they're really doing good in these local communities, but they haven't heard from the founder of that organization. So for the first time, with AI translations, they can hear from them directly. So we want to help them speak to those people in their native tongue. Uh, the challenges that we faced, we couldn't even do what we do now uh, with HeyGen. So it just wasn't possible for ministries, nonprofits, or even organizations to do the translations that they're doing, to do them at the scale, just didn't exist. And so HeyGen is unlocking new capabilities, new skill sets. Uh, that organizations didn't have before. And so it's creating rather than replacing. It's optimizing, it's making efficient, so it's doing a, a plethora of things. Um, but the most exciting thing is that it's creating new capabilities that didn't exist in the customers and organizations that we serve. We had been doing audio translations and that was pretty remarkable. You get the voice, but I wasn't sure if we would be able to do video translations where it didn't look kind of cheesy, right? We've all seen the old movies where they do the lip dubs and it was way off, the emotion, the cadence, it wasn't there. But when we did video translations with HeyGen, we were able to capture the emotion and the cadence, the movement, the lips of the speaker in their voice and their likeness, giving their message. That's pretty remarkable. I didn't think that was possible. There is, there's so much impact. Uh, there's so much content being created that's reaching an English speaking audience, but there's such a vast world out there. And as we become more connected with the internet, 
Um, AI seems like the the next stage to to bring that connectedness because internet the internet brought down these these geographical barriers, but we still have these language barriers. But with HeyGen and AI translations, there's no more language barriers. So I'd say to all the content creators out there, you now have expanded your audience pool, the people that may resonate with you and your message, hundredfold, thousandfold. You have a global audience. There's no more borders, whether it's physical or language. The magic that it's created in a lot of these organizations and nonprofits is truly remarkable. It's inspiring. The messages of hope that they get to share uh, to people across the world that interact with their ministry, whether it's food drives in different countries like humanitarian efforts or business centers teaching business literacy to women or uh, literacy programs for children, they're able to communicate with them in a, in a direct way, these founders of these organizations with the people that are being impacted by those organizations. And it's creating such dynamic relationships and new relationships that didn't exist. So uh, translations has been remarkable for us.